I think appetizers are the best part of the meal. Yes, even better than dessert. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make jalapeno poppers. <music> For this recipe, you're going to need one and a half cups of plain breadcrumbs, enough vegetable oil to fry them in, three jalapenos, 16 ounces of cheddar cheese, one teaspoon of smoked paprika, a half a teaspoon of salt, a half a cup of flour, one fourth teaspoon of pepper, one egg, and one cup of milk. First thing you're going to do is grate the cheese. It's always better to have the freshly grated cheese over the kind that comes in a bag. Next, you're going to remove the seeds from the jalapenos. A lot of people like to wear plastic gloves while working with jalapenos. I didn't, but I thoroughly washed my hands after doing this. Next, you're going to mince the jalapenos. Now in a large bowl, mix the cheddar cheese and jalapenos together. Roll a handful of the mixture into balls and place on a baking tray. Place the tray in the freezer and freeze for 30 minutes. Get three bowls out in an assembly line. In the first bowl, you're going to mix the flour, salt, and pepper together. In the second bowl, you're going to mix the egg and milk together. And in the last bowl, you're going to mix the breadcrumbs and smoked paprika together. Coat each ball in the flour mixture, the egg mixture, and then the breadcrumbs and place on a plate. Place the plate back in the freezer while you're heating up your oil. Heat the oil to 350 degrees and cook just a few of the balls at a time so it doesn't lower the temperature of the oil. Fry the poppers for two to three minutes until they're golden brown and the cheese inside is melted. Remove from the oil and place on paper towels to drain. 
These are one of my favorite appetizers. If you've never had these before, you definitely need to try these. If you do try to make these, let me know what you think in the comments below. And if you haven't subscribed yet, don't forget to do so before you leave so you don't miss out on any great recipes. 